Eight years ago, a club was formed to offer competition and recreational soccer to youth in our community. The popularity of the sport has led to the Village's Soccer Club, a premier development league. On Monday, Daily Sun reporter Joe Pedersen was with the club at its very first practice. A new team arrived at the Village's Polo Club on Monday afternoon to call home. The Village's SC took to the field for its very first practice of the 2016 Premier Development League. Today is the first, first practice day for our uh, season. Uh, we have players here from out of state, out of country, local players. So we have about 18 players right now. We have uh, other players coming, flying in tomorrow. So it's, it's just a, a very exciting day, for, exciting day for our community and our, our, our club. There are 26 players total on the team coming from all over the world, including Brazil, Portugal, Spain, England, and South Africa. But some players came from as nearby as the village's high school, like John Vazquez, a junior at VHS who's learning to adapt to his more experienced competition and teammates. I'm learning that the game, uh, to, to make quicker decisions and um, the physicality of the game. Since everyone is much bigger, I need to step up my game. I need to start, start training harder, hitting the gym harder, and focusing more. Coach De Silva is excited about the talent on the team and is itching to start the season strong, which begins on May 7th against the Florida Surf in Port St. Lucie, Florida. I mean, this is a dream come true for me. Uh, we have been working really, really hard, and this is it. This is the day. This is the start. We're not going to take lightly, even though it's our first year, but we, we, we want to make a history. Uh, so. We, we, expect it, we expect to do a good job and then to make to the finals. As the first team to represent the Villages, pressure and expectations are high, but not nearly as high as the excitement for the start of the season. For more on this story, check out Keith Perlman's article in Tuesday's Daily Sun. With this VNN Report, I'm Joe Pedersen.